This local sports report is brought to you by M&T Printing, offering banners, brochures, business cards, and more. Check out their website for a wide range of printed products at mtprint.com. A pair of familiar faces have returned to the Elmira Sugar Kings this season and they will help bolster the Kings back end. Anthony Azano and Dawson Shackleton are back after a one-year absence and they couldn't be happier to be wearing the green and gold. I missed it. I, don't know. I went back home last year and didn't feel right. I wanted to be back out here. Missed the community. So close to the community. And uh, we do a lot for them, and they do a lot for us, so much for us. And uh, I just had to come back for my final year. There's really no other place kind of like it, especially from like my hockey career going back. Um, just really feel like the same. As soon as I came back, it was kind of a different taste. You know what? Like playing back in the, in the OJ last year was a little bit different, and um, you know I'm really happy to be back. Shackleton is an overage defenseman going into his final year of junior hockey. Last season, he played in the Provincial Junior Hockey League with the Glanbrook Rangers, making it all the way to the Schmalls Cup Championship Series. Hard work and aggression, a lot of uh, try and bring some leadership too. Obviously, I don't have a letter, but it doesn't mean I can't go out there and tell guys, tell the younger guys, like teach them some things and uh, go out there and work my butt off. I expect Dawson to be a shutdown defenseman. He can he can make a good first pass. He's a he's a decent skater, um, but we need him to to play defense first. Um, if we're making life difficult on the forwards coming in on whether it's Kimmel or or Warnock. Um, you know, everybody, especially him, just got to play a little nasty game. As for Azano, he was on the ice last year with the Pickering Panthers in Junior A hockey in the OJHL. Both Azano and Shackleton have championship experience playing for the Sugar Kings Sutherland Cup winning squad two years ago. It's really good being back here again. Two years ago, it was a really good stretch we had as well, but I'm really looking forward to coming back again. Looking for a good year with the boys. Our back end does look pretty strong. You know, we got like a lot of good guys back here, a lot of good path personalities, and we bring a lot of skill to the ice as well. Um, I really feel like we'll bring kind of an offensive threat also. I think we're slowly starting to stick together here. The team's starting to work how they should be working, and uh, we've been working really hard at practices and uh, focusing a lot on our uh, conditioning and speed and. Basically, we'll just have a real strong team this year. We pride ourselves on putting good people out there and good people uh, throughout the organization. So for them to want to come back here when they could have gone anywhere is, is fantastic. Um, you know, to have those guys who we won with come back as well is, is large, um, just to have that, that influence in the dressing room. Elmira kicks off their regular season on the road in Kitchener on Saturday, September 15th. The Kings home opener goes the next day on the 16th at 2 o'clock at the Dan Snyder Arena. We want to win. Elmira, we're, we want to win. Um, are we looking down the road right now? No, we're, we're focused on Kitchener game one, Brantford game two here. Uh, as cliche as that sounds, you know, we, we want to put ourselves in a position to win. Um, but right now it's, you know, we're 0-3 we're so far in our last three preseason games, so we're looking to get back in the win column. It doesn't matter if it's playoffs, preseason, regular season, we got to do everything we can for, uh, for a win against uh, Stratford at home, our last preseason game, and then Kitchener and Brantford. That's our, that's our focus right now. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.